Eat Dittles. Dittles from Connecticut. How you doing, guys? Uh, first of all, let me give you a shout out. Uh, Mike Sola up there in the ICPA, the best teacher in whole Connecticut. So I put that away. Uh, now, as you see over here, uh, we got a evaporator there. And uh, I just see it. I just decided to uh, make a quick review over here. And uh, as you see there, the pan and uh, this one, when I take this out, that's right there, it's the office. That one's uh, 0 0.59, 0 0.59 offers, and you see right there, nice and clear right there. And uh, maybe I could, uh, later on I do that, I'm, I put some uh, crust in there, so you could take a quick, better quick peek over here. Now this one, it came out out of the furnace where the set the real set this thing out to real you know real close to the to the heat exchanger and look what happened right there it's it's like the whole thing got melting down big 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 time and uh just windows keep popping up over here on this thing uh right there right there right there if you see right there it's it's all melted out i finished Damage this thing. I let, I went to I went to lift it up and uh and the the whole thing just came apart. Yeah, it's, it's a piece of junk. I, what, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get a new uh pan there, and I'm gonna set it up. I might could use it. I got a back room where I need an air conditioner there, and I might set up this thing in the summer. And maybe we might do it together. Set the whole thing up and uh get it going. This 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 evaporator in particular. Look, if you look inside. Nice and clean. Nice and clean. It's because that lady, she just just to keep up. That's what happens when you change the filter like every other month. You know, your your evaporator stayed nice and clean. And uh, I was surprised. It was a little dust in the bottom, but I wiped that out. But other than that, see that. Now, at one point, this thing, when they start leaking, they, you know, you got to start looking near close this corner over here. If you look inside there, in those corner there, you got to really look into it because that's where that the weak spot is. And when they usually leak, they look right, right, right there, right in this corner there. That's where they, they leak. For some reason, I don't know, maybe because it's shaking and then all that moving inside the furnace there. And uh, right there and on the bottle. And... Uh, but this one in particular it doesn't look that bad. It doesn't. It doesn't look that bad. And right there, that's another point right there, where a potential leak. When they start leaking, they just leak from there. And believe it or not, when they start leaking, that you might as well tell that lady, listen, you need a new system over here, a new evaporator, and sell a new one because you're gonna spend a lot of time trying to fix, and sometimes they leak, and then when you time. Heat up one thing, the other thing get loose. It, it, it could be a header. So you might as well tell the customer, listen, get a new evaporator, and it's over, you know, right there. You see, I'm thinking about this one, if I hook it up or not, because you see the corrosion on the bottle there? That's where the weak spot is. And what happens is those pins, they get clogged, and the water sit there all summer. And that's what happens, get corroded there. You see the water just that's the pan there, and the water just go up and down there, and then it drain. You're gonna see the drain now, and uh, you know this one doesn't look that bad, but this over here now, you see right right there in those little spot there, that's where. Uh, now this is the drain pan over here. You see the drain there in the corner there. See right right here right here. This is where the water goes out to you condensate condensate pump. See, you put the connected pipe, and then they do water drain out. And sometimes those drains get clogged, and uh, the water.